that's the footage of the truck. This isn't a $200,000 truck. This isn't a uh, Mercedes that costs you $3,000 a month. But this is something that I am extremely proud of. It's got a lot of really unique features, some rock climbing features, you know, speakers in the headrest, a really cool dashboard, big screen, a workstation for your laptop, big 31 inch, you know, grippy tires. Really just extremely proud of this truck. Like I'm happy with my purchase. And I don't know if that's a personal development where I'm happy about things I did and I'm not just striving for more all the time, but I'm just pumped about the truck. It's nothing extremely special. It's a Ford Tremor. It's a new package they came out with last year. Uh, it's about a seventy-five to $78,000 truck, depending on the package you get. I got the top technology, huge sunroof windows, sprayed bed, LED lighting. Uh, this truck has a lot of cool features. The leather seating has got a little bit of a, some orange tint and special seats in it. Uh, I love the thing. I'm proud of it. My kids love it. My family love it. We're going to use the shit out of it. I think we all need to strive to be grateful more for the things that we're able to do because of the hard work that we put in as entrepreneurs or business owners. I think it's very easy to get caught up in the social media game. Well, well Rob Bailey's got that new F450 that costs a buck thirty. This truck's only seventy-seven thousand. Still, it's a $77,000 truck. That's a lot of money for somebody to spend. And we should all be a little bit more proud of our accomplishments out there. Um, yeah, I bought a nice, a nice cover. A cheap one, but uh, this weekend just so happened. I did have steak and salad. I wish I had steak and salad. <laughs> Fucking kill it. Warmed it up and yeah, you just don't. I'm gonna have a better Ford commercial than the Ford commercial. Uh, Ford's gonna call me, dude. We're gonna make millions, Dev. Mm -hmm. Me and my friends have a great time in this boat. So can you. <laughs> Seller financing possible <laughs> at approximately thirty-four ninety-five a month. Yeah, we gotta. Uh, so I just got done with my. So on his little hundred dirt bike with his son, and his daughter's got this little mini go kart thing. I personally hate dogs, dude. I absolutely hate them. I like other people's dogs. I will never have one. That just looks like a headache and responsibility. That I no, I like other people's dogs. No, but I like Hudson. You hate dogs. I never knew you. No, you don't. You don't even pet my dog. You're like this thing stinks. Don't worry. Hudson smells like cheese. No, he smells like shit, dude. You can wash a golden retriever, and he smells like shit six hours later. <laughs> We got the guy. Paul, oh, did you hear the story? I was running for my life. I was running for my life, dude. Sandy happened. Like, the arc, I thought the arc was open, but then it almost floated away. But then I thought I should probably be at the arc because the Noah's arc saved the world once before. Noah. So, Noah's Ark. The it's arc. The, it's the, it's the same the thing. Noah. Sandy was coming. Very simple. Noah's Ark. I literally, I was reading Noah's Ark as you guys were talking shit to me last night. Are you gonna be a man of the Lord now? No, we just said Riley wanted to read it. We got yeah, the, to, the Bible for dummies. Good. It's like literally like four sentences each. Um, I think it's actually very good. It's good. Yeah, I, I, last night I was telling Colton that why Rob doesn't have any more vlogs. And I said, Rob's horsey passed away. Rob's horsey sleeping? I said, yeah, he's sleeping. Oh, no. And he goes, can I see him? I said, no, we can't see him. He goes, when is this horse come back? I said, well, he, he died. He goes, he died? And then he's like, well, where does he go? I said, he goes in the, in the sky, to heaven. So then he's like, heaven? And then it kind of like mm -hmm. went to this conversation. And I'm like, let me Google this. There's got to be a quick video. Yeah. Why is that brother hitting that brother? I said, because that brother's mean and that brother's going away. Oh, yeah. I have a whole story. That's only half the size of it. He gave me a free cigar because he forgot to give me the lighter. Right, you know you don't have to put all of the packets in at once. Well, no, he gave me this with this free cigar in the, in the bag. Oh, oh, he gave you one. Because okay. he forgot to give me the lighter, but yeah, look, this lighter works. Yeah, go on top. This lighter works, he said. Oh, yeah. Oh, same one. Same, yeah. same. Yeah. Simple. Hell yeah. Same, same. Great minds think alike. Yeah, so. Phil, Phil is now a cigar aficionado. I'm an aficionado. I have now, everything in here. Now that we got. The tampon out, and he's on to cigars. We just got to get him on so to this bourbon. Is the, this you just got to delete, dude. You got to delete all that foam. Oh, no, I have, there's the last there. time Phil had yeah, bourbon, I'm protecting this. I had to protect a 65-year-old woman at 
Charlie's from him. She was quite flirtatious. And she With was me? trying to remember she was trying to rub your leg. She was she was oh, there with her brother. The guys, weird the relationship. Yeah. yeah, that was weird. The <laughs> uh, they were like, there he's trying like, to help each other free. get laid, yeah. and then I'm not convinced that well, they didn't lay each other. You know, some yeah. of these are uh, nice Trevor and said super light. Some of these are are like on the sweeter side. I have to say, dude, recently that's the metallic that that, that was like heavy. Light, light, fuck. these light yeah. like they're they're a lower end Rocky Patel cigar, the ones with the wrap on the front. We smoked the I shit really out like of them. Like four There's or five a medium of them one and a light one, dude. They're, they're great. footage in the boat and I want two race boats to come out with us. I'm gonna give you time. I love that that's your go to every that's time. That's our go to. Something just. I have so much footage of Ryan taking a piss. <laughs> so much I need you to take more. What? I I have, I have so much footage of you taking leaks. That's Kramer. Okay. Really get it. it. Yeah, they don't get it. They take it for granted. Not so. so tonight I went out. We were talking as four good friends more than anything. Uh, we talked a ton about business, life. Um, we had a couple beers, nothing crazy. Put the drone up. We almost lost the thing in the water. We <laughs> barely could land it. The wind's pretty crazy. But I really look forward to nights like this. No wrongdoings. I think more of us should actually spend quality time with other men in our life that push us to be better. And that's what the four of us did here tonight. And it was awesome. I want to beat up the point of like, no one's drunk. We didn't have to get crazy. But I think just getting around other good men, strong men, is extremely important. And more of us need to do it. Oh, he's a big boy. That's why he's giving that side.